So the first thing we do is preclinical studies. We test that in animal models and preferably which are akin to or close to human beings. Now, if we find that it is safe, then we are not satisfied completely. We go for human trials or the clinical trials, we call it. In phase 1, we go for safety profile, phase 1 trial. In phase 1 trial, what we want to look at is, is the vaccine safe? For that reason, we choose healthy volunteers who are at the pink of their age. For example, for corona vaccine, we have chosen 18 years to 55 years old. If at all any side effect comes, it should not be because of some inherent problem inside the body. Then we introduce the vaccine and then look for what are the side effects. Immediate side effects within one or two hours, which could be anaphylactic or any serious reaction or over a long, long period of time. In case of Corona vaccine, we are following them up for 194 days. We check the blood sample of the person after completion of the vaccine, at least 28 days after the vaccine. Now, in that antibody title, if it is sufficient enough, then we say that, ki, yes, this is, vaccine is working. Stage 2, where the priority is given to the immunogenicity or antibody level which has been generated inside the human, in the blood. Phase 3. In phase 3, we look for if the vaccine, which has both safe as well as immunogenic, is it been able to prevent you from developing the disease? In such a case, in phase 3, we go for a large-scale study. In a large-scale study, lot many people are given to a group of people we give the vaccine, to a group of people we don't give the vaccine and observe them over a period of time. Are they developing the disease? Because otherwise, the, all the people have got the similar exposure, but a group we have protected them with the vaccine, a group we have not protected. Is it control or a placebo arm? Now we will see three things. Number one, in the group who have received the vaccine, how many people are diseased, developed the disease, and in the control arm, how many people have developed the disease. Second, again the blood examination will be done to check for the immunogenicity and antibody titer. And third, again, is the vaccine safe? Because in phase one, we tested in healthy volunteers, which are small in number. But in phase three, large scale, it, any side effect which has to come up in a rare side effect also, when you are testing in a large number of people, you will be able to detect it. So this comes all about the phases of the clinical trial, preclinical, phase one, phase two, and phase 3. We will go for introducing into the public. That comes the phase 4 that is called post-marketing surveillance.